You know, communication is really the key to success in medicine. To be able to transmit images, to transmit data in real time using all sorts of smartphones and tablets allows me to make better decisions. The more I know about a patient, the better I can help that patient. A patient may walk into an emergency room complaining of pain. When did your chest pain start, sir? Uh, this morning. They would get an electrocardiogram and they say the patient may be having a heart attack. One, two, three. And because they may not have all the facilities uh, available to manage that patient, they would contact us at MedStar Washington Hospital Center. Moving kind of fast, I don't want you to be nervous, but the sooner we can get in and find out what's going on, the better it is. Okay. So in the past, though, I would say, fax me the ECG. Then I would have to be at my end near a fax machine and have to wait for it. That's 10, 12 minutes. But for someone who's having a heart attack, it is a lot of time. So now I can be anywhere. I can just flip out my mobile device, turn on the special app, Code Heart, that we developed in conjunction with AT&T, and to start transmitting or receiving live images it's just one touch. Can you see or do it? what do I need to do? And I can look at the ECG if I can confirm that they've made the correct diagnosis and then immediately use our resources here, call our helicopter service. I'd like to dispatch a helicopter immediately. Okay, call MedStar, please. So that's the difference in the way we can react. We can reduce our door to balloon times or the time it takes for us to process a patient and effectively treat them. We can react much faster and for patients with heart attack, for every 10 minutes that you wait, mortality can increase by as much as 1%. Virginia, I need you to be perfectly still on these pictures, okay? So I do think that this application can save lives.